how do they feel about you? All right, so this is going to be a quick read. We're going to start off with Capricorn and end with Sagittarius. This is a collective message. If this message resonates, guys, make sure to leave a thumbs up. Don't forget to comment, share, as well as subscribe. And share with your family and your friends. All the way from Capricorn to Sagittarius. How do they feel about the collective? All right, let's get it popping. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. All right, so. Capricorns, how they feel about you. We have Strength card, which is the card of Leo and the Ten of Cups. So you could be dealing with the Leo and someone here possibly wants a relationship with you. A Leo possibly wants a relationship with you or someone is refraining from uh, getting into a relationship. Aquarius. I feel like they could feel as if you're at a distance. Okay, or someone wants to communicate with you, but someone is closed off. But I'm feeling like some of you, some, um, they could be feeling as if you are distant. Okay, I'm even picking up on like a trip away. Pisces, I'm getting asking questions. Someone could be asking you questions. Someone's possibly asking questions, and someone is getting offended. They may feel like you're getting offended by a question that they ask you. Aries, I have a coming together, a reuniting. Okay, a second chance, okay? Someone wants a second chance. Someone wants to come back around with you, wants to reconnect and rekindle things with you, okay? Taurus. Someone wants to come out of conflict with you. Gemini. Someone feels trapped in... Um, some type of agreement or trapped in a marriage, trapped in a financial situation, but somebody feels trapped, okay? Somebody feels stuck. Cancer. You could be dealing with a Capricorn, but someone here is wanting to put in some type of effort, okay? Leos, we have juggling, okay? We have juggling. Someone can feel as if you are juggling, okay? We have the two of pentacles, four of pentacles. Four of pentacles is refraining and being selfish and kind of holding back. So maybe someone could feel as if you're juggling and trying to keep them to keep someone to yourself. Someone's juggling, but someone's trying to keep someone to themselves. Virgo. Someone is, they're waiting to take action. They, they aren't making any moves right now. They're waiting to take action. Libra. Libra, someone here, they may feel as if you have options, okay? You, you need to make a decision. They feel like you need to make some type of decision. Most definitely, someone has options here. All right, Scorpio, you could be dealing with the Pisces, but I feel like, they feel as if you are hiding something, like you have something to hide. And <laughs> they feel like, like you have something to hide. Okay, and Sagittarius, they're waiting for you to, somebody could be blocked or uh, I'm just getting like, they're waiting for you to let your guard down or someone here is wait, someone here is blocked. And they're waiting for you to let your guard down. I'm just getting waiting for you to waiting for you to let your guard down. Waiting on you. Why is the nine of wands here for Sagittarius? Yep, waiting on you to let your guard down. They're waiting on you to let your guard down. That's what this is. Okay. 
I want to pull a few oracle cards, just at least one, just to get the energy. Let's see what additional messages we have for my collective. What message do you have for the collective? We got to release your ex, okay? Someone that you may have thought was your soulmate. You may be feeling the need to release your ex, or some of you have to release your ex, or is thinking about releasing the ex, okay? Let's get one more message. Give me a message for the collective, please. We got triumph so this is for movement okay so a lot of you guys you could be dealing with an ex okay spirit is saying to move forward okay forward movement and we got transformation which is the death card so this is things ending okay ending a cycle here ending a cycle here looking back at the situation with regrets possibly because you have to move on but Things are going to get better if you move forward, okay? There's progression and things picking up once you, um, some of you guys have to release an ex. Some of you guys have to let something from the past go, all right? So I hope this message resonated, guys. And if it did, make sure to leave me a thumbs up. Don't forget to click the bell to subscribe. And let me know what's going on in the comment section below. Ciao for now.